Fellowship, Brother Adrian. Brother Adrian, welcome to the show. Hello, my child. My children, both of you. Welcome to the now. So good to have you on the show. Yeah, it makes a real break from the whack jobs and crazies I normally interview. You know, our guest Booker gets us celebrities, but the, the publicist makes us take these has-beens and... You're a pervert. All right. I'm happy. You're miserable. I'm not miserable. Okay, I'm in a career slump. There is a difference. Every time I really start to do well in a market, someone at the station goes whining to HR, and then I get moved to a new place, like a like a man of the cloth. And speaking of cloth, you're a cult leader. So, of course, you pretend to be happy, because you say you have all the answers. You're selling people. Oh, 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 hope is a lie. Swiss watch, but for some swingers or so. 
stops you. There's a, a great hole of lovelessness inside you. You're just a shell. Nobody cares. Your, your friends are more successful than you. They, they won't call you back. They, they don't even re-bleach you anymore. Your, your life invader friends start to go down. The, the private members' clubs tell you that you're no longer welcome. in there, you know, it, and then they start calling you a misogynist in the press and a bleeder, and, you know, it's not true. Laszlo loves women. I love women. They call me gay, and that's not true. Laszlo's a man. He has a man's needs. Uh, only it, it, it still keeps coming. The, the great wall of shame and the self-loathing just flows on and on like you're on the ground, and there's just a group of men urinating on you, but it, it's a hypothetical urination. Then one day your producer comes in and says, Laszlo, even though you've been a syndicated radio host for a long time, and even though you're great, now you're gonna you're gonna be the co-host. The assistant to the host. Shut up, okay? You won. You're perky. You're young. You look great. And I'm the assistant to the host of a woman with literally nothing to say. I get it. You did a mountain of blow in the 90s. It was no one cares. It was fantastic, okay? I'm glad you had blow all over your nose for many years. You don't have a catchphrase. I don't need one. And nobody gives a shit. I was big in the 90s. I was I remember dot com and we used to program computers like C colon forward slash and HTTP forward 10 print hello 20 go to 10. The great terror of time is something we cover in our study program, my child. <laughs> Just leave me alone, all of you. There, there. Sometimes from the valley, we can see the mountain through the clouds. That's what makes us its children. <laughs> I don't understand valleys or clouds. It sounds like a nursery rhyme. Oh, you take a minute, Laszlo. Man, listen, anyone saying the male menopause is a myth? Just remember this moment, please. It's very simple. You just work through a very cost-effective program and achieve limitless joy. That sounds wonderful. Laszlo, stop crying. I've... I'm not crying. Well, thank you, Brother Adrian. Your seminars seem very interesting. Yes, very But I think we've run out of time on Chattersphere. I love you, Michelle. Oh. This has been the Chattersphere with Michelle and Laszlo. We all love authority. Isn't it time you became an authority figure? Have you always wanted to get paid to stand around and yell at minorities and rapists? The West Coast leads the country in correctional facilities. Locking away half the population means a career opportunity for you. Become a correct...